Hello YouTube and welcome to another Squirtle Squad opening. In this video, I'll be opening up a Hooper EX Pokemon Tin. Now, if you follow me on Instagram, you'll know that it was recently my birthday and actually got this as a birthday gift. Really happy to receive it, um, especially since I've never opened up a tin on my YouTube channel before. So this will be a first for me. And I believe the packs it contains inside, is inside also are packs that I haven't opened on this YouTube channel yet, so it should be a good opening for me. Now, let's just give you a quick view of the tin. Actually, let's get the plastic wrapped off first, and then you can have a better view without the plastic wrap. You won't get any glare from that plastic or anything. So let's get that plastic off. So there we go. So the tin looks like without the plastic wrap. Obviously being a Hooper EX tin, it's Hooper on the front here, as well as here. On the side is Rayquaza, Rayquaza, however you want to say it. Latios on that side. And then on the back, it just, as a little explanation, shows the three uh, Pokemon on the top here. These are obviously on the other tins. On this series, you get Latios EX and one of them requires an EX in the other. And it says inside, let's see if I can get that focused. I don't know if that's going to be readable or not, but it says in this tin you'll find one of three special foil Pokemon EX cars. Obviously, in this case, it's Hooper EX, four Pokemon TCG booster packs, and a code for the online TCG. So, let's get the tin open. Take out everything that's inside. So there's the code card that you get. I am going to put that to one side and use it. And then there's the four booster packs. Let's see if we can pop this out safely. I know these cars can get damaged quite easily with these tins, but I think that came out pretty well. And now I'm just making the mess of the tin. Let's put that to one side. So, closer look at the Hooper EX. Nice looking card. So, Hooper EX, that's Black Star Promo XY71. Definitely a good looking card. I think it's my first EX promo card as well, actually. That's really cool. And then we got the four booster packs. So looks like we've got two Ancient Origins, one Roaring Skies, and one Primal Clash. So I'll leave the Ancient Origins to last. We'll go oldest to newest. I'm trying to think what oldest is. I think it's Primal Clash. Either way, let's go that side. So let's go Primal Clash, then Roaring Skies, then leave the two Ancient Origins till last. So as I said, this is. Really cool for me, not only have I never opened a tin before, never opened Primal Clash on this channel, never opened Roaring Skies on this channel, and never opened Ancient Origins on this channel. So this is going to be a really good opening for me. So here's a Primal Clash booster pack, Primal Groudon on the front of it, and the code card, and we'll move to one side. And there's a rare, rare and the reverse size back of the pack. And this first pack of the tin, we have Sphil, a Torchic, Meryl, Surskit, Zigzagoon, Whiskash, Archie's Ace in the Hole trainer card, Bibberal, the reverse hollow is a Mudkip. So that's a common reverse holo card. Definitely a cool looking card though. I remember seeing this card before. Let's just make sure this is in focus as well as it can be. I think it actually is. Definitely a cool looking card. I really like the look of that card. And the first rare of this tin is a Mercargo, which is an ancient trait. I do like the look of these ancient trait cards. So, non holy rare, but really cool looking card nevertheless. So now we go on to Roaring Skies booster pack. Rayquaza on the front of this one. 
Another thing I have to say, Rayquaza or Rayquaza, I'm sure it doesn't matter that much, but hey. Move the code card to one side, and free from the back. And first one starts with Pikachu. I do have this card, I actually have a different version of the card. It says Build the Bear on the top of, sorry, in the bottom corner here. Build the Bear limited edition uh, version of this card. So now I've got the regular card too. And there's Bagon, Wingle, Swablu, Shuppet, Requires a Spirit Link, Electrode, I love this Electro card, I think it's quite comical. Dragonair, your reverse holo is Winona, that's an uncommon trainer um, reverse holo card. And the rare in this pack is an Unpheasant, so another ancient trait, non holo rare. Okay, so now we're on to the two ancient origins packs. Primal Groudon on the front of this one. It'd be nice to get at least a holo out of four packs. Let's hope we can get that in one of these two packs. Of course an ultra rare would be even better. So, Ancient Origins, we have an unknown. Baltoy, Malamar, Combi, a Golet, Energy Recycler, Matang, Sablai, the reverse holo is a Lucky Helmet, so that's an uncommon trainer card. And the rare in this pack is a Regirock, non holo rare. So, down to the last pack. Let's hope we can get a little bit of last pack magic here. Last pack of Ancient Origins, Rayquaza on the front again. There's got to be something good in this side. Can't, in this pack, so can't even open it. And the code will move to the one side once again. And the last pack of this Hooper EX tin, we have a Meowth, Gumi, Baldum, Oddish, Inke, Lissandre Supporter Card, Ariados, Levable Trainer, and the Reverse Holo is a Whimsicott, which is an uncommon. And the last rare in this tin opening, it's not a ultra rare. Let's hope for a holo at least. And it is an Entei. So that is another non holo rare. Very good non holo rare at that. Entei, obviously, a very powerful Pokemon, legendary Pokemon. But unfortunately, we got four non holo rares in that tin. So definitely not great odds there. Pretty unlucky, unlucky tin. But it was still nice to open four packs. Three different sets, all of which I haven't opened on this channel yet. And it's nice to open a tin, which I haven't done on this channel yet. And of course, we still do get this Hooper EX Black Star promo card. So, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you very much for watching. Before we go, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe to this channel, and in the description of this channel uh, on this video below, I'll leave links to my Twitter and Instagram account. And until next time, thank you for watching Squad Squad Openings.